in the midst of the T-virus outbreak in Raccoon City. Claire Redfield succeeded in escaping from the city, along with one of the only other survivors, a young girl named Sherry. However, behind their escape was the lone survivor of the Raccoon City Police Department, Leon S. Kennedy. What have we got here? Stay out here. Head to the police station. It'll be a lot safer. Radio's out. You're a cop, right? Yeah. First day on the job. Great, huh? Name's Leon Kennedy. Nice to meet you. Mine's Claire. Claire Redfield. I came to find my brother, Chris. Hey, could you open the glove box? Sure. There's a gun inside. Better take it with you. you there. Okay. At the same time, at the same place. You have to survive this nightmare. To 
to know the true end. So we are back now doing Leon's campaign. Hey, look at the DeLorean. Nice. Could use that and go back in time and not ever come to this city. But yeah, we're doing the Leon campaign now, so we get to see kind of what happens on the other side of the story, what Leon was doing all this time. Luckily this time we don't have to worry about not picking ammo up at the beginning. And also, look how quick we get to the police station. <laughs> Compared to Claire, who has to go through, like, a chunk of the sea. Hello, guys. What are we rocking? Got our handgun. H&K VP-70, manufactured by H&K Germany. Uses 9mm parabellum rounds. And he's got the lighter as well, instead of the lockpick. We take the cabin key. Hey, I don't want to get trapped in there. I'm not going to bother shooting everybody because we don't have a great deal of bullets just yet. And then I want to say maybe this campaign's a little bit harder. We've used the cabin key. The key's useless now. Discard. Yes. Mainly because of I don't know a certain enemy that you have to deal with. You can avoid a lot of the time, but we'll see. Hey, there's some bullets. Can you take the hitch gun on bullets? Yes, please. Yeah, we'll grab the, the ink ribbon. Why not? Need a chest. So this is the... Oh, sounds like they're broken in. So you, you briefly come into this room with Claire. But if you open this door, you get attacked by zombies. You pick up the the valve in here, which is for some reason not here, but we won't worry too much about that. So I was kind of thinking to myself in the cinematic, like, they get in the car and then start heading for the police station. Why don't they just turn around and go back the way they came? Just leave. I mean, I can understand Claire maybe wants to stay to try and find a brother, but what's Leon's? reason to stay other than to get to work on his first day or whatever. Fuck that, just leave. Get the hell out of town. I go further in. Hey! Get over here! Hurry! I can't sit her down. I'll drop you a rope ladder. Grab onto it. Come on. Just a little more. Oh. Yeah. Ah. Get off me! Leon did nothing to help. So that's how the helicopter crashes, I guess. How that guy couldn't kill two zombies with a machine gun, I don't know. Rip. Guess we can't do much about it until the fire's put out. But this is where things don't start to make sense, because I'm pretty sure you have to put the fire out as well as Leon. Which makes no sense, because Claire did it. But try not to think too much about it, because a lot of the puzzles and stuff just really makes sense. But we won't worry about it. I think you could put the fire out. Maybe you don't even go back out there, I don't know. Ooh, a herb. I think you do go back out there. That's when you get attacked by our new friend. Right after you come back in. Okay. Same thing with the crows again. Well, the crows are already busted through. So the windows are all broke, right? See, it already makes no sense, because that would mean that Claire has already been through here. Hey, guys. Mind if I loot this guy? You. You unlocked it. Get off. Fucking birds. And again, Claire unlocked this door. And now Leon's unlocking it. I don't know if we can go through the other door, because the safe room is through the other door. 
can't see it being locked. Why would it be locked? Let's go and check and store some things. We don't need this knife, do we? No, thank you. Okay, good. Oh, liquor straight away, huh? No introduction for him. I guess he doesn't need one, because to get to this point you would have had to play the first part of the game, so you would have already had the introduction, technically. Because this is just a continuation. Is this the same diary? Because it is, I'm not going to read it again. Yeah, it is. No point in reading it again, it's the same thing. Okay, four ink ribbons. It's about as many as we used in our first playthrough. Okay, so these are the small keys that you'll need for the drawers and whatever else. Same as for Chris in our Resident Evil 1 playthrough. Everyone should just bring a lockpick with them. Pink ribbon's there, I think. Let's just store the knife. Down here where no one can ever think about it again. Uh, let's head back up. I will drop off the hearing. I don't know when we're going to get to the chest, or the drawer, sorry, for this key. So I don't think we can get... Because it's just past the library. And then there's one downstairs in the main reception. Which, there's a chest in there anyway, so we'll just store it for now. Not as familiar as how this playthrough works exactly. So I'll just be kind of going places and working out as we go, I guess. I assume we can head through here into the lobby, but... Do we want to? I guess. We can kick the ladder down, that gives us more access or whatever. Some zombies. Oh yeah, there's an item at the other side of this uh, lobby. Leon. Let's uh, kick this down, even though Claire puts it down in her playthrough. have to be as sparing with bullets this time, hopefully. You're not dead. You are now. Isn't there a bunch around here? Oh, Jesus. So that's the unicorn medal in there, I think. Uh, label and library. Yeah, I guess we've got enough bullets. I just didn't want to waste all these pistol bullets on these zombies. Shotgun would have been quicker, probably. That guy actually died. I thought he was going to play dead. Did he take the unicorn medal? Sure thing. So that's where Leon gets it. Claire gets it from the star's office underneath Chris's diary. Let's head down and put it in, I guess. Ooh, there's our shotgun. So this is the crossbow for Leon. And I would argue it's better than the crossbow. Because it's a shotgun. Shotguns are great for zombie killing. Oh, we don't have a key card, so that's useless. Not fountain, something is written here. To obtain the key to open your heart, I'll wait for the unicorn and the beautiful beast. Well, here it is. How many keys are in there? Recent key. 
It's in the shape of a spade. I forget what doors are locked. Is this one locked? Yeah, okay. Pretty sure they're all locked then. Locked from the inside. Okay. Then we want to head back up then, I guess. And then we'll head back down those other stairs and into the offices. We have to think about when we save as well. I think of what bosses. I mean, the bosses are generally at the same time as they were in the first part, I guess. But now we have an, an added issue to deal with throughout the game. Again, this is not like a optimal run or a speed run or whatever. We can save as many times as we want. I'm not really bothered. Uh, do we keep the shotgun on us? There is liquors around, it might be idea, but we don't have many bullets. Hoping I can just avoid said liquors for now. I know there's one out here, but we can avoid him, I think. Fairly easy. Goodbye. We may have to kill him eventually because we're gonna have to go to the rooms beyond it. On the burning helicopter. Uh, why have I got a black screen? Rub roll. That's not good. I think I may be starting again. Shit. Okay, I'm back. So. I had to replay the game again, and I got back to where I was before we came through this door, and I quick saved with the emulator in case it was going to crash again, and it did do. Twice in a row. I don't know why. So, before I tried, tried anything, I just kind of took the shotgun and went and killed... The, there was actually two liquors in the room before here. Killed both of them with a the shotgun, and then came through the door, and it worked. I don't know if killing the liquors made a difference, but... I'm hoping that's not going to do that again, or often, because that will get tiresome if every door is a question mark, if we can get through it. I don't know why it did that. A bit worried now that every time we go through a door it's going to crash. Okay. Let's see how it goes, I guess. Maybe I should save more often if it's going to start doing weird shit like that. So we have wasted some shotgun bullets. I didn't even know there was two liquors there. I was just aiming at the one on the wall and managed to start hitting two of them and they both died at the same time. So. And the only other difference is that we got an extra peck from a crow, I think. And the bullet usage might have been different. Depends how quick the zombies died in front of the, uh, the unicorn medal, but it's not an issue. Still got plenty. Oh. Okay, what, can we look at the map? Okay, we need to get the map. Something we can actually do this time. Probably, I mean, you could do it anyway, but because we know this safe combo, we can just get straight in this safe without going to get the. Uh, I still remember it. Two, two, three, six. Beautiful. Okay, shotgun shells. Fill my inventory up. I love it. PlayStation map. Looking nice with the bullets. Is there herbs back here for Leon? Sure looks like it. Oh, I need to combine something. Wish you could do it while trying to pick them up. I think we're ready for a chest again already.
I'm going to use these two shotgun shells up. Just so I can then combine those into the gun. Okay, we can still take heads off instantly. Hello, fellas. Do you want to line up? Maybe I can hit two of you at once. That'll do. Oh, you only have five in? We can put seven in. I guess that's the original shotgun. You there? Yeah, okay, I've got them both. Nice. Okay. Another ink ribbon. Jesus, I've got loads of ink ribbons. Are they trying to tell me something that I need to save often? Guy's down there. We could just leave him. Oh, should we kill him again? Save bullets. Stomp the head. Nice. No kicking this time. Leon's all about the stomp. Oh, yeah. Can't pick it up. Okay, that's fine. We'll come back. Should we go clear out here? Because I can only imagine it's jumping out here again. we got the shotgun. We can mow the load down over it. Oh, shit. Crap. Oh, already injured. Okay, that's fitted in the space. Let's go back to the pistol. Those two are injured at the very best. The hell are you aiming at? Yeah, he's dead. I'll grab this herb and use this one. Get back to full health. And then we can go back for the crank, I guess. Okay, let's reload. Do we want to go down there? Probably not. We need a bunch of keys first, don't we? Need the green and the purple key. There's one room we can go into. We don't have inventory space, so there's not much point at the minute. Assume this door is locked. Oh. Isn't it electronically locked for Claire? So that leads back to the lobby. Not that we need to go there. Though you could argue that that would have been a quicker way back to the safe room, I guess. But I need the, I need the valve, don't I? So. Never mind. Let's grab this then. And go put the fire out. Safe room first. So I'm probably going to save, not because I'm worried about dying, but due to the game crashing twice in a row. I mean, I'm hoping now we've got past that bug or whatever it was. But I don't want to have to keep replaying the game. So I'm going to save a bit more often, I think. Sure. Let's throw a save real quick. Don't really want to, but again, it doesn't matter. Uh, we'll just oversave Claire's. We don't really need them. 
Now we need to go put out the fire. But then we're gonna run into a friend. So I'm thinking, do we want to take some healing with us? Probably. Let's keep these in this slot here. All my herbs up above. We don't need the small key yet. I should have maybe saved some shotgun shells for this encounter that's coming up. Sure, we'll be fine. Well, Leon doesn't get like the bazooka. Oh, grenade launcher, sorry. Not bazooka, grenade launcher. But he does get upgrades for his guns. So he's got the pistol. He gets an upgrade for the pistol that allows him to shoot, like, a burst of three shots. He gets an upgrade for the shotgun that makes it kick like a fucking mule. And he does get the Desert Eagle as well. Does he get the electric gun thing? And he can get the submachine gun if we chose not to give it to Claire. So yeah, we can get some gun upgrades. Let's put this bad boy out then. Even though this makes no sense, because Claire did this. <laughs> Gotta make sure we go loot stuff. From the chopper. Guessing pistol bullets. <laughs> Helicopter is a complete wreck. Oh, it is shotgun shells. Nice. I'll come in useful then. For the encounter we're about to run into. Which I will equip for. Because I was thinking, do we run or fight these encounters as we run into them through the game? And I think, just to make it a bit more of a challenge, we're going to try and fight him each time. Because he does drop stuff as well. Sometimes? Heck's gonna give it to you. Now, technically, he should be right through this door because he landed right in front of this door. But for whatever reason, he's like down the hallway. Well, we can't go back that way anymore. So let's see how this goes, shall we? Eep. Does hitting his head make a difference? <laughs> Health am I on? Of course. Oof, that one would have probably hit for more. And face plant. So, you can loot him for stuff. Whether the loot he drops is worth the ammo you waste putting him down is a whole other question. But we'll try and find him each time. We'll get some practice for the next game, shall we? There's the birds are gone. Uh, what are we doing next? What? Oh, I guess we... What did we achieve by putting the fire out? I guess we can get to the room past the helicopter? But don't we need the gems?
No, we're just gonna piss him off. And let's. Now, is there gonna be a liquor in there? Do we want to drop the shotgun off? Probably not. Drop the valve off though. Wouldn't be needing that for a while. I will grab a basic green herb. Hopefully that's enough to top me up. Oh damn it! We don't actually have as many heals as Claire did. Oh, at least not yet. Okay, let's go see what it is past the chopper then. I feel like we still need the red gems though. Before we can go in there. Is the key card in there maybe? Probably gonna be a liquor in here somewhere. I don't know if it's now or after we put the gems in. Not yet. Oh. Oh nice. Didn't know they were there. Nothing usual. Ah, there is something. Your key card, nice. Go use it on the computer. There it is. I was like, does that happen after or before you put in the crystals? Bit easier to deal with than the hunters, aren't they, in the first game? I figure we kill him now because we're going to have to come back anyway. Okay, now we can head down into the lobby then. And use the keycard to access the rest of the, the building. Yeah, I'm a bit concerned about our inventory space at the moment. Maybe we'll store the shotgun for now. Stop using it. Save it for later. I'm gonna drop this heel off. Uh, do we open access to the library now? No, no, you know what? It doesn't matter. I was gonna say we can get open the drawer in the other safe room. Once we've opened it up. I don't remember what's in each drawer. Because there's the drawer in front of, or just before the library. And then there's one in the reception. this right now. I'm pretty sure I do. You have to just interact with the computer. Oh. You never know what way you do it. Do you have to interact with it first or just use it from your inventory? I feel like each freaking thing's different. Okay. Reception's open. Library's open. I don't remember what's in each one. I feel like there's a gun upgrade in the drawer upstairs. Maybe I should get the small key and open that one first. Maybe. Oh, hello. Not used to there being friends in here. Okay. No head for you then. This we've read before, so I'm ready again. I'm sorry, what are you shooting out there and hitting nothing? How many of you are back there? Okay, I want 
to get a small key and see if we can unlock the library drawer. Because I feel like there's a pistol upgrade in that drawer. I might be misremembering that. That could be like Leon A, not Leon B, which we're on now. I find it weird that the canon, as far as these games go, playthrough is Claire first, even though Claire is technically disc two. So anyone that didn't know how this game worked would be like, oh, well, we'll put in disc one first, right? But doing Leon A and Claire B is technically the wrong order for the story to make total sense. Not that anyone really cares, because the story is so fucking messed up at this point, it doesn't matter. Red herb. Sure, pick this up. I wonder if it... Ah, you see? So it's still paying off the... Oh, well. Those shutters were still closed from when Claire closed them. How is Claire so far ahead already? If she's closed that, that means she's already going down to the the basement. We've not even run into her yet. You, you run into her in a minute. It's no sense. It's all out of whack. So we've run into her in here. So we see Sherry, right? Okay, let me open this first. Desk is locked. Will you use the small key? There it is. The uh, H gun pots. So this gives you your burst fire capability, I think. They look like parts for a gun. Oh, don't want to give me more than that. Does it say anything else? Burst. With a stock holster. Capable of firing three rounds, auto bursts. I did notice that you can change it there, look. Auto. Manual. So I guess auto fires three shots. Manual. Just goes back to firing one. I can see why you'd maybe not want it on on auto because something might not take three shots to kill or might be nearly dead. I don't know, maybe you can actually just get it to fire one if you press the button lightly. Hey, wait! Hey look, she dropped a key. Or was that key just there? Who knows? Another key already? It's in the shape of a diamond. Ammo in here. Shotgun shells. Nice. Leon! Claire, you made it! Yeah. Have you seen a little girl around here? Yeah, you just missed her. Who is she? I don't know. But it's too dangerous for her to stay here alone. Leon, I'll go look for her. You go and find us a way out of here. Of course. But before I forget, here's a radio. That way we can keep in touch if something comes up. I'll go look for her. You go and find us a way out of here. Will do, boss. Uh, are we done with the library? Not really, I guess we should go. Yeah, I mean, I guess we can go do the library first. Inventory's getting a bit of an issue already. Just keep picking up random crap. Because I'm pretty sure we need to do this puzzle as well. Is there a liquor out here? Should we go kill it now? It's either now or later. Try out our burst shot. Oh no, we're, we're clear as a... Clear as a bell. Nice. At least for now. In fact, I feel like Mr. X attacks you up there. Somehow, at some point. Probably when we're ready to go up there. Uh, 
again. Claire fell through this. <laughs> Does someone fix it up real fast and wait for Leon? Pretty sure the puzzle is still the same. Now there's a different item in there instead of the stone that Claire got. Fair enough. This is one of the chess piece. Keys. This was mentioned in a note about a guy who was playing chess with somebody. And that he was using these to lock some sort of door. The bishop plug. So they're, the, they're the equivalent of the stones for Leon or rests from the first game. Okay, now what? Because our inventory is very full and we have kind of a few options at the missed point. We can go back past Claire and go to the star's office. Or we can go the other way, down through the safe room, past where the liquor corridor was. I guess we could go that way because then we can bypass a chest. Dump this crap. I am. We need the plug for a while. Red herb. Keep the keys because we'll hopefully be using them up. So now we just need another small key for this. I feel like maybe that's what you find in the meeting room by the fireplace. I constantly thought there was an item there. We'll see if I was talking buttons or not. If there actually is something there. His head is missing. It seems to have been twisted off. Yeah, I want the ammo. There it is. Looking good, 58. Plus whatever's. There we go, that's one key down. I assume the crank is in here still. get this file again. <laughs> Same thing. Oh, it's a first aid spray. Nah. I mean, we'll get it, but... So where's the crank in this game then, do we think? Don't remember off the top of my head. Could be down in the basement somewhere, maybe, in the area you don't go as clear. Because with Leon, we'll get to go past the parked police van that was blocking the way in the car park. With some help. Green herb is still here, which we can combine with that red herb now. Hands and a, and a cob through that actually made me jump. And that's the first jump scare to get me in this whole game. Considering I played it that many times, should be used to it, but again, playing the B campaign is rarer for me, I guess. Uh, this is what we've read, right? I don't think we'll see many new ones, to be fair. So we can do this straight away, because Leon starts with the lighter. Personally, I think the lockpick's better, but... Hey-ho. 
Okay, that's the first one. Where was the other one? Oh, mm. where was the second one for Claire? Right, is this item a myth or am I? No, I am right. Oh, it's bullets. I was expecting like a small key. I wonder why that's not there for Claire. Could have bloody done with it. Are these guys going to be a pain or can I get past them? Can I kill this guy and get him out of the way? Can I just tap? Oh, okay. So we don't have to worry about wasting all three bullets. I can just single tap and not hold it to fire one bullet. So I don't have to worry about wasting unnecessary bullets on something that's already dead before the second and third bullet hit. This room is nice and quiet compared to the Claire's. Two herbs. Okay, we have room. And then we reach the safe room with the special locker in it, which obviously we can't open as Leon on this B campaign, because we don't have the key. A special kind of key is required. But it I mean, I wasn't planning on doing it anytime soon, but if people are interested in me doing a uh, Leon A, Claire B, which is the opposite to what we did, then I might do it, and then we can see his alternate costume, and the he just gets to hold his gun sideways, and it fires a bit faster, I think. I don't, I don't really know if that's all it does. But I'm more than happy to do that in the future if people want. I'm going to do it in the remake anyway, when we get around to playing that, just because I never did it. When I originally played the remake. I've only played the remake once, which is kind of bad. I need to play it again. But we will go through them all again. We played Zero, so we're ready to play Resident Evil 1 remake, and then we'll go to 3. We just did 4. But yeah, I'm more than happy to play this again in the future. At some point, if people want to see me do Leon A, Claire B. Uh, we'll grab this. <coughs> But I won't be doing it in this set of videos. I don't think we're going to move on to three after we finish Leon B. We have so many bullets. I'm loving it. Let's store this then. First aid spray can go. I'm going to get the red herb out and combine it. See if we can save them for the last boss like we did. Claire. Even though the bosses differ slightly with Leon due to having Mr. X wandering around causing trouble. Okay. Don't think there's anything else. And develop film. I'm probably not going to bother developing the film unless we find one that we haven't found as Claire. I don't know if he can do that. Maybe he can. Maybe he does through his campaign. I don't know. So I think we found A, B, and then D. D being like the secret one with Rebecca. I wonder if we can find that again. If it's the same one. We can try and see. I assume it will be. I, I want to save just because of it crashing. I might just emulate save. But it's purely for if it crashes. If I die, I'll quite happily go back to the load that we actually made. But if it crashes again, I don't want to have to play through it all again. Due to things out of my control. Um, where do we need to use this red key? Or is it purple key? Oh, can we unlock that door there? Okay. We'll see if we can do that then. Get that used. That's what I'll do. Every time we get to a safe room or a typewriter, unless I actually want to physically save, I'll use the emulator save just in case he wants to crash again. But then we'll manually save like before bosses and stuff or whenever I think I might need to. Everybody in here? 
That's nice. Oh, there's film. Well, I guess I'm taking it. Whatever. Well, we're going past that save point anyway. Do we still get the C4 in here? The lock is broken and can't be opened. Oh no, because yeah, Claire opens that with the lockpick, doesn't she? I mean, doesn't Claire at one point say that she's removed the rubble? So does she still do that? Or do we have to do it? I forget how that works. Do we even go there? Back past... into... Heinz's office? Shut your moaning. Okay, we're, we're collecting some heels now. Is that another key? Oh, that shot missed. Oh Jesus, we're getting all the keys thrown at us. The shape of a heart. I just need the green key now, that's it. It's a photo stand, possibly a family photo. Didn't know that was a thing you could interact with. Oh, there's the other small key, which we can use on the drawer on the other side. So you can't see it here, but this locker here, you can only really read the nameplate on it when you're in the cutscene with Claire, when he's, she's talking to the cop. And it says Jojo on it, which apparently is a reference to Jojo's Bizarre Adventure or whatever, which I know nothing about. Uh, Memo to Leon, we read this one as Claire. Nothing really new. I think that is it then. Unlock this door, I guess. Should we go use the small key? Get it done? I think it was just a first aid spray for Claire. Is it the same for Leon? Still need to head upstairs, don't we, and do the star's office. I say I'm not bothered about the film, but part of me wants to just go do it just to get it out of my life. Instead of clogging my inventory up in the chest. Oh, it's shotgun shells for Leon. I will take that. It's better than a first aid spray. Store those then. Don't have that many yet, but we're getting there. Um, okay, let's head back towards the dark room and then we'll head upstairs to the star's office. It's probably quicker to go through the lobby, but I want to get rid of this film. Again, I don't think it'll be anything different. I do wonder where film C is, though. Claire didn't find one. So maybe it is like a campaign B item, I don't know. I instantly want to go to the, the box, even though I'm not here for the box. Film B. 
Yeah, we've had this one. Where's film A? I don't remember where you picked that up. Uh, I will emulate save just in case it decides to crash on me again. Doesn't look like it's going to, but who knows. Maybe it's just that door. Maybe I didn't like the fact I didn't kill the hunters. Hunters? Lickers. Oh yeah, the other red crystal's here. I completely forgot about this one. Uh, let's redo this puzzle again, even though Claire did it. But now there's another one in here. Don't question it. No, this is the door as well. That's the one that Sherry kind of crawled through. That's the other side of that. Where she went from there, I don't know. Right downstairs, if I had to guess. Because what, we don't see her again until the outside of the basement area? You mess this up, you have to just leave the room and come back and it'll all reset somehow. Again, people should really learn to pull objects and not rely on pushing. Probably better for the back, but still. Okay, that's red gem number two. So that means now we can head back to the room with the, the statue in it and put them in. But we'll go check the star's office first. Is there anything left up here? And of course it's popping off. Mm. Mm. Alright, I've got ammo to spend. Let's see how many there is of you. What are you crawling for? Okay, I'm gonna jump in here. See what happens when I come back out. If you play Leon first, you meet Claire in here instead. I did wonder if you get the Magnum this early, Jesus. It's probably going to be our best gun, as far as pure damage goes. There are unopened cardboard boxes. It looks like a rookie's desk. Did I not lose something from there last time? Am I misremembering that? Diary is still here. Maybe they don't actually. I mean, it makes sense that they wouldn't actually be picking these up and keeping them. Because we're running around with a lot of files. So maybe they're just uh, making a note of them. Just noticed uh, Jill's beret on there. On the desk. Pistol bullets, my gun is empty again. Okay. Shall we get the picture again? Okay, I'll be right back while I try and grab this picture. I think it'll be the same thing, but there we go. We got the creepy picture. It's more creepy just because of her face than it is of the actual what the actual picture is. So pay our respects to the stars members one last time. I wonder who the mystery man is in the corner. Who's just not named. Okay, I think we're done. I don't think you even meet Brian Irons or whatever his name is. It was Leon, if you play the B campaign. Is he still going? Huh? Ah. Uh. 
Nope. Oh, fuck. You were very quiet. <laughs> don't even know why I'm bothering. Don't really need to go back through there. Might as well head back this way. Develop this stupid film. Even though I said I wasn't going to bother, I've already developed half of them. Once I've done this one. I'm just curious if I can find the other one. There, there must be a C, right? Can't just go A, B, D. Yep, still the creepy one. The face just looks so weird. Okay, let's store the Desert Eagle. Won't be needing that for a while. You can also get an upgrade for this, I think. Get like an attachment to the front of it. To make it even better. Uh, should we go do the red gems now? Where are we heading? Here, yeah, we're heading back to the other side of the mansion. Mansion. Police station. So we'll head up there and do that. Get that done. I think there's another plug in there. Another chest plug. Get that done and then we can head back downstairs and head... I think we can head down to the basement now. So yeah, we'll go do that, I guess. Cool. Quick save, just in case it decides to crash. I'll be more worried about it doing the same door it did it last time, but you never know. Don't want to risk it. Uh, go this way, it's the quickest way. I think we'll be running to Mr. X again. So I can have my shotgun ready. Let's just check the map. So we could go to the purple door there. But we don't have the green key. So maybe come back once we've got the green key. And then just clear it all in one go. It just means we'll keep the key on us for a while. Which is kind of annoying. I mean, if that's the only door we've got left to unlock with it, we could store it until we've got the green key. But then that would rely on me remembering to pick it back up again. Remember to pick it back up. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Let's go put in these gems or whatever they are. Get another plug before heading down to the basement. bloody window in here now. Some idiot breaking the window. I assume there's nothing else in here, right? Oh. 
Of course. Yeah, that was there for Claire as well. That thing we don't really need that many of. Ping plug. Okay, we'll go store this. And then we'll head for the basement. I don't think there's anything too bad down there to deal with. Just dogs and... Does Leon get liquors down there? Don't remember if he does or not. Maybe. We could take the shotgun just in case. Store that. Store that. The shotgun is fully loaded. I won't take the bullets, I'll just take the gun. Because we should be getting the backpack that Claire left us, so we'll have more inventory space. I mean, we've got this pistol that's got burst fire now, so. Whether we actually need the shotgun is debatable. Oh, I'm going to save before we head through this door again. Not this door, but the next door is the one that crashes. We'll see if it does it again. Please don't. At least this time we have more options, we can just go a different way around. Okay, phew. Did I not kill you guys? <laughs> yeah, I've already started, I might as well finish you. <laughs> again, that's that key gun. Why is that populated again? Yeah, yeah. This is the room they all kind of piled back in. Him over then. Oh, you son of a bitch. How are you not dead? Now you're gonna make me. Oh, wait, we didn't pick the green up. The green herbs up? I guess I was too busy killing. That works out then, because there's two right here. You use one to get back to full, and then save the other one for. Oh shit, we've used all our bullets up. Uh. Whoops. Thought we had loads left. I guess not. Is there nothing here? This door's still locked, that's the green key. Oh dear. We'll have to be a bit more sparing then. Dogs still? No. I don't like hearing nothing. Oh, hey guys. I'm gonna... Shotgun you guys. Just to save bullets in the pistol. Does this thing need turning on again? Sounds like it's already on. We 
uh, reserve power control panel. Power can be routed to the areas with infinite power using these power switches. Cut the power supply. Is this? No, it's not on. Okay. I assume it's the same as last time. It was just up, down, up, down. Yep. I feel like they should have changed it so it was something slightly different. Oh, map. Totally take that that we don't need. Okay. We'll uh, leave the parking lot till last because I think that's progress for us. Where the hell did you come from? You're making me waste my shotgun here. Could probably avoid a lot of you, but or not. No. I assume it's just dogs out here still that we can probably avoid again. Second red herb. We'll get the pistol out just in case. We have to deal with the dogs. Don't know if they're already down and about. Because they had to jump down last time. No, I don't think they are. I don't even think we have to come down this way, to be perfectly honest. So this may be a waste of time. There could be an item down here. I would hope. This is where we run into... Sherry. The fence is broken. It's too small for an adult to enter. I mean, you can make it bigger. These silly little things that stop you. No, there isn't anything in here, is there? Nothing at all. I mean, we can store stuff. Reload the shotgun. Just in case. Drop off the herb. Keep one on me just in case. Shotgun shells I will drop. It'll be fine. I will quick save in case of a crash. Now we have to run past these dogs because we've upset them. Don't get stuck. Yeesh. Oh yeah, we didn't kill you, did we? I should have maybe had done before we uh, reloaded the shotgun. They were locked. Okay. Did I not kill you? Damn it. Well, no, we killed him anyway. Power to the card reader is on. We don't have the card yet. Uniform, I thought you were another zombie. Who are you? Ada Long. And what are you doing here? I'm looking for some guy named Ben. He's one of those reporter types. Always. 
always looking for a scoop. I heard he was locked up in the cell block, only there's a wrecked car barring the entrance. I've been trying to find another way inside. Give me a hand here, will you? Your thing, Ada. It's nice to see you. I'm sure you might be a constant pain in my ass. Grab that. Let's push this thing then. This is the area we couldn't go as Claire because Sherry skipped going to the gym. Not strong enough to push that bad boy. Okay, let's go see what's in here. Ada, wait! No one ever listens to you when you say those things. They run off and vanish. And yet somehow she still comes in behind you when we get to where she's going. So where she disappears to, I don't quite know. Only two rooms down here. First one is the kennel. Which I feel like I should put these dogs down now because they're going to be a problem later otherwise. I'm gonna break out. Sorry, puppies, but you gotta go. You, you bad dog. Hey, look, another red hub. Which is a different one to obviously Claire didn't get this one. I wonder if that goes to the total count, though. What did we have? Five with Claire? We're up to three now? I do wonder if they're not breaking the doors open, though. That says Jojo there as well, though. Is that dog called Jojo? What is the obsession with this Jojo? I uh, might be able to open it if, with the right tool. So yeah, we need a manual opener. But yeah, I wonder if they, when they break these down, is there any items in there that we could have collected, maybe? I'm not sure if there is. I don't know why there would be. Dogs keeping herbs and ammo in their pens. Oh, here's another film. This might be film C then. Control panel to release the lock. The lock appears to be open. Oh look, our first blue herb. For some reason there's, there's herbs in these cells for some reason. It's nice for the prisoners to have something to look after while they're in here. Let's actually mix our first three herb heal. Inventory's looking a bit busy again, isn't it? Should be getting the backpack soon. Let me guess, you must be Ben, right? Get up, now! What do you want? I'm trying to sleep here. Where were you, Ada? Is this the guy? Ben? You told the city officials that you knew something about what's been going on, didn't you? What did you tell them? And who the heck are you? 
I'm trying to find my boyfriend. His name's John. He was working for a branch office of Umbrella, based in Chicago, but he suddenly disappeared six months ago. I heard a rumor that he's here in the city. He was in the mansion. He's dead. I don't know anything. And even if I did, why would I want to tell you? Okay, I say we leave him in there. Does anyone know where they put the key to this cell? I have it right here, officer. But I'm not about to leave this cell. Those zombies aren't the only things crawling around out there. What was that? Like I said, I'm not leaving this cell. Get out of here before you lead it right to me. Hey, I'm not going anywhere. I'm the only cop left alive in this building. What? Look, if you want to live, then you're going to have to leave with me. But do you even know how to get out of the city? There's a kennel in the back of the building. Inside the kennel is a manhole. Go through and it'll lead you to the sewer entrance, but it won't be easy. All right, I'm going. Yes, we know where that is. We were literally just there. Okay, inventory is now very full. I will combine these herbs. Oh, I can also reload, which will free up more space. I'm always looking a bit bleak. At this point, the dogs would break out. Okay, I guess we're out of our inventory. Of the inventory, so let's go see what's down here then. Because we're not done with the police station yet, so we're not heading into the sewer yet. Ugh. I think we're going to do a bit of a like it. Excuse me, chaps. But I don't have the ammo. Ah. Storage. Well, the blue herb, I guess, because of the spiders, huh? Another ink ribbon. So we get to play as Ada now. This is kind of the same section as what you did with Sherry. Combine them. Keep a green on me, I guess. We'll store this for now because we can get it back out in the dark room. I think I'm going to take the shotgun and the shotgun shells with me until we find pistol bullets. How do we go from so many bullets to so little? Don't need to go in here yet, because I think we'll check in case there's ammo in here. Don't think we get the boss fight yet, do we? I hope not. This is where we need the plugs, the chest plugs. Looks like a panel to release the lock. 
There are descriptions for the plugs. King plug insertion, rook plug insertion, bishop plug insertion, knight plug insertion. Yeah, that's where we get our kind of boss fight like Claire got in the, well, past Chief Argens' torture room or whatever. That's Leon's equivalent. Oh, hey. Ada? I don't think I've introduced myself yet. My name's Leon. I'm with the RPD. I don't care. It's a dead end. You think we can get upstairs through this shaft? Give me a boost. I'll go and check. Why do we want to go upstairs? We want to go upstairs, just go back the way we came. Hi, Sherry. How cute. That little girl must have dropped this. I think I'll hold on to it for her. Okay, we get to play as Ada. I do wonder when that takes place. Is that as we're playing as Sherry? Because we came in here and picked up the ammo, right? And then we left. Or is that after we've been back to Claire and then she's come back again? Doesn't really matter, but I'm just curious. And I did wonder where her pendant went, because she does have it in the first time you meet her, and then it's gone later on. So, what's uh, she got on her? First aid spray, handgun, some bullets. Can I have these bullets? Film them. Check. Picture taken fairly recently. So, I guess that's John, is it? from the mansion, who used her name as a password. So the way she holds the gun, I think is what you can get Leon to do, if you play as him first, and get the special key. So it feels like it's slightly faster than just firing it normally. Might as well spam these bullets. We ain't gonna see him again. You sneaky little git. Uh, we'll go this way first, because this will be optional stuff. And I assume ammo that we can throw at Leon. And then we'll go get the green key, I assume. There we go, some shotgun shells. Kinda need pistol bullets, though. That's it, I guess. Throw those at Leon later. Try and knock him out with Grab the map, I guess, for this very small area. And then the puzzle for these boxes is identical, I think. Again, I feel like for this campaign they should mix it up just so it's not exactly the same. Oh. Maybe I shouldn't do that one first, because I might move it too far. Should really do this one first. At least she can climb a bit faster than uh, old Sherry. Oh, 
I love it to fill and drain water. Well, let's do it. Again, didn't Cherry just do this? Should already be set up for us. Keep a lot of these keys around, don't they? In the shape of a club. Can we take the water back down? Guess we can. Because I want to listen to that horrible sound again. Nice. Okay, that's us done then. Let's go back to Leon. Which gets him another key. How many plugs did we need? Four? King, Queen, Bishop and R Knight? Was it? How many do we have? Three? No, two, right? Leon, can you hear me? Ada, did you find anything? Right here. Think fast. Here's one more. Donk. Straight on his head. Kills him. Hey, I can't reach the ventilation hole. I'm going to have to find another way around. I'll catch up with you later. You could get up there. There's pipes and things to climb on. What? Ada, wait! The door's already closed. She's gone. Who are you talking to? Leon, come in. I found the girl. And I've cleared the wreckage that was blocking the corridor. Got it. Wait, that makes no sense either. Because when she calls you then, that's when she finds you finds Sherry in Is it? I think that's when you find Sherry in the just past Chief Iron's office, right? And you turn the light on and she's there. I think. But then you meet her later down here. But that's already happened. So you just saw her there. The timeline makes no sense. Oh, why did I not pick that up? Get in my inventory, damn it. Shall we put some plugs in now? Then we've got half of them, right? King and Bishop. Just to save us having to get them all out at once. I know we have a boss fight in here, but I don't think it's yet. I think it's once we've got all the other players. Two more. King, Rook, Bishop, Knight. Okay, so there's one probably up in the clock tower, same as there was for Claire. Even though that was a stone tablet thing, but whatever. And then the last one. Would be in one of the interrogation rooms, I guess. Uh, sure, it's spider running past time. Keep. Ah! Just 
charges down the hallway. They always want a hoax, really. We don't have the key card yet either, do we? Oh, we can open. Oh, it's in the autopsy room, isn't it? It's like, where's the key card for the the weapon locker in the goddamn autopsy room, which we now have the key for? I feel like there's maybe liquors in there for Leon. Maybe. Hey, doggos, what are you doing out here? I'm gonna save the bullets. It's all the same to you. Even though I've got to go back that way at some point. Might be better for ammo by then. Are you kidding me? You guys are sneaky little bastards. Make no noise. Then I clear this out once. Pain in my ass. I hit. Guess not. Oof. You were a sneaky little bastard. They aren't really bad time to have a reload. My phone should have been counted. Douche. We're about to full health, shall we? Now, hopefully, there's some ammo in the uh, weapons locker room, whatever. Now, mm. oh, shut up. Uh. I haven't done that in a while. Press the star button for the inventory. We got out of the habit pretty fast. Last playthrough, but. Apparently it came back there for some reason. Ooh, magnum bullets as well. Couple of pistol bullets. Thank God. Okay, that's reloaded. Reload the shotgun while I think about it. Grab this. There's a side pack. Yes, we will equip it. Side pack is being equipped. There we go. Two more inventory slots. Beautiful. I guess that is it. Okay, what's next then? I guess we go upstairs, open that door, and then we can head through towards the interrogation room. Where the fuck have the zombies gone now? Oh, you're there. I thought you were further up the corridor. Like, they've vanished now. I'm sure I'll forget about you when I come back down. Oh my guys. <laughs> guys are friggin' everywhere. Oh, beautiful. Double kill. Sick of clearing these rooms. I can't see shit. Uh, camera angle. Change, please. <laughs> Kill a few with a pistol, I guess. Or 
one. Ugh. We need to remember to get the other key out. Before we head to the interrogation room area. It's still empty. A shame. Guy didn't have anything on him, did he? It's annoying. This is the note about the chess pieces. Swords acid rounds. Magnum rounds for Leon. Okay, I guess that's it. <sighs> we can go develop this film. Which I'm sure is very pointless and not interesting, but... It's the only one we didn't find is clear, so... So I guess you can't get them all. There must be one that Leon can't get, right? So we've got B, we've got D. This one I can only guess is C. Where was A? Yeah, it's busy in here again, isn't it? Um, We will head upstairs then. the storage box get the other key I'm actually going to quick save because I'm worried about it crashing in this area again we might actually manual save soon I think we're going to be running into Mr. X soon I think he attacks us in the interrogation room area. I think what we take with us to deal with him. Do we want to waste the Magnum this early on? Probably more beneficial than wasting the shotgun shells that I need for everything else. Just don't know how many shots it will take. Maybe do a couple and then finish him with a pistol maybe? Do we have any more clips? Is that it? Okay. Um, key. Before I forget, we've got the lighter already, because he starts with it. No, I don't want that. Do we go do the film first? I guess we can go do that when we're on the way to the clock tower. I'll take this and maybe use it on him. We're going to get rid of the keys, so that won't be an issue. We'll proper save now, though, before we head that way. We're going back to the uh, the dark room. It's kind of out of the way now. We don't really have a reason to go back there. Other than that picture that he's doing. Should we take a heal? So we're going to get rid of these. Along the way. So that won't be an issue. Should be enough room, right? Um... Let's actually go this way. Unless this is now populated by somebody else. See, there's all the zombies in that room again, or whatever's down here. Which could be a liquor? Yeah, it's a liquor. <laughs> Can we just bypass him? You bitch. And you fucking injured me as well. What a dick. Use that heal, I guess.
It's not really populated in here, is it? Seems to do it everywhere else. So like in here. I think it's going to be dead. For a specific reason. Uh, I won't go in here yet. Let's discard that key. Let's go in this one first. Oh, there's the other red herb. How many are we on now? Four? Come on then, drop down. Are we still going to get one that smashes through the window as well? I have to guess, probably. Hey, Mr. Bullets. Probably it. There's another plug. Okay, so that's the, the other plug. I couldn't remember where it was. I figured it was down here. But the other one's in the clock tower. Uh, just use this key up. Grab the red herb. We'll grab it on the way out. Just in case. I mean, we've got loads of inventory space, but I don't think we're going to pick up that much. There's Dead Spring. Which I will grab first. Because I'm expecting this window to bust in again. Fuck. That one got me. Thought it was after the fucking... Shoot, then. But it happened after I picked up the plug. Would you stop? Pain in my ass. Where do you even come from? I was just in that room. And don't tell me it's the same one that got back up again. Not their logic. Probably gonna have to heal. I might wait for another hit or two though. Before I use the first aid spray. It seems a bit of a waste to get to full. But we're only on caution. I will grab this now. Two slots left. And we will equip this. Okay, same deal. Make sure we grab these bullets. Oh. Was it a first aid spray for Claire? I thought it was bullets. And I generally think that a lot of the times. Uh, I, say, I assume this is still the same. Oh, I've now forgot what the order actually is. It's already lit. What does it tell us on this thing? Each of a man on a carriage on these ring on the wheel. Like the Queen, the King and the Jack. Queen, King, Jack. Queen. Oops. King. Jack. And Mr. X, that still made me jump, even though I was expecting it. Now, oh, fuck it, I have three. 
Depends what he gives me. I don't think he gives you something every time. Okay, cool. Nice. No, I don't care about the picture. Pick up the damn cog. Wow, we've actually managed to fill our inventory. Okay, back to the chest. And then we need to nip down to the dark room, get that stupid picture out of the fucking way. <laughs> Guy's persistent, huh? Okay, another three. I, I feel like he's not going to drop anything this time. Just because we literally just killed him. I say, go down, sir. Making me waste more bullets. I mean, I don't have to fight him. I could have run. We chose to take him on each time. Oh, he does drop something. Okay, I'll take. Again, it's worth all the bullets we wasted, I don't know. Then I'm pretty sure he attacks us again when we get to the clock tower. He's gone from like that one attack to like just attacking us completely repeatedly. We haven't seen him in ages. And now he won't give up. Um Do we just go to the storage chest where the dark room is, I guess? No point going back up to then go back around to the other storage room. we could dump things here. Log. Uh, we're going to need that in a minute, so I guess keep hold of that. Thank good for that. Yeah, combine them. I'll reload the Magnum, I guess. Might as well grab the film, I guess. Didn't combine those herbs, did I? Lovely. Do we keep the shotgun shells as well for now? Should we store them now that we have some pistol bullets to run in? Don't actually have any single green herbs at the minute, do we? Hmm. One, two, three, four. So unless we only find one more red herb through this whole game, it's the same amount of Red herbs as Claire finds. Okay, let's go do this stupid picture. And then we'll head to the clock tower. Wait, do we have the crank yet? Do you need it as Leon? I think it might actually just be in the room. Where you need it. I don't know where else it would be. It's the only place we've not checked yet.
there's normally a night room there. But not this time. this just for this stupid picture. Okay, this is film C. Development of code T zero uh, one zero three. Due to accelerated metabolism, relative to the earlier 00 series, this subject possesses exemplary regenerative capabilities. PHX016 file data. So that is literally a picture of a, I guess, a naked Mr. X. That's what it looks like when you derobe him. I guess that explains why you don't really get this film as. Claire or whoever you play as on B, because they wouldn't even see Mr. X. Okay, well that's that done then. Now we just head upstairs to the clock tower. And I hope I'm right about the crank being in there. Unless it's already just down. We will head this way. quicker if we're gonna fix this bloody door. Instead we have to go all the way around. This ready. Does he attack? I swear he does. I remember him climbing up there. I'm pretty sure we don't need to go back out here now. Unless the crank's not in here. Which it's not. Where have I not been? Am I dumb? Oh, we haven't been... Oh, I forgot that. The, where Chief Iron's office is. Shit. Yeah, we can go there now, because she cleared the room, right? That must be where the crank is. Oh yeah, I remember now, it's in the... It's in the box where Sherry hides. Damn it. Totally forgot about that area. We've got to go there first. I'm pretty sure we run into Mr. X in there as well. Like I say, he's like a dog with a bone at this point. You see him once and then don't see him for ages and then he just doesn't stop. Uh, I guess we gotta go back across the the walkway out here. Should we kill this liquor? I 
Can I hit him from here? No. Can maybe lure him down here though. Got a shotgun. I guess I can get past him easily enough. Come on, you dumbass. Okay, that worked out. So, I'm only gonna have to come back. Fuck you. Pain in my ass. So, do I need to drop the gear? I don't know if we're going to be picking that much up. Probably not. Nameless last words. Need a single herb just to top back up. Here's diary. Uh, this thing we can't do anything with. Tiger. Suppose we'll grab the other diary. No value. No real reason, but. Yeah, there it is. Okay. You, Mr. X, I think. Tell about the music. Two. Three. Oh, only three that time, huh? I was ready to pump four into him this time. Because it was like three and then some pistol bullets. Nice. Oh, nice. <laughs> Worth it. Three bullets for eight back. Even though he's going to show up again when we get to the clock tower. <laughs> I will reload then. Okay. We are about done and ready to go into the sewers then. Once we've grabbed this last plug. Gonna quick save, I'm terrified of it crashing again. Even though it's not done it since. Did I grab the gear? No, I still had it, right? Okay, uh... That's fine. I'll store the magnum bullets later. Because once we get the plug, we can drop down the chute, which takes us straight back into the sewers. Or the basement level. And then we can go down to the sewers. And put in the plugs.
So this time we should be attacked by Mr. X up here. Unless I'm completely making that up. Pretty sure I'm not. I can see it in my head. How he climbs up here, I don't know. I guess he can just jump when he wants to. Don't make me a liar. Yeah, yeah, I'm a liar then. I swear I remember him doing it. Maybe if it's we go if we go back out the door once we've done all this. I'm curious if it's worth killing him this time. If he does actually climb up. Will he drop? I didn't think he dropped something every time, but he has done so far. the night. No one does shoot. Will you jump down? No. Can I choose to jump down now? Okay. Let me just go see if I am talking absolute bollocks. I want to see if he does actually do what I thought he did. I know at this point we're just looking for trouble, but I'm sure I remember him climbing up. Interesting. I can see him climbing up there. But maybe I'm thinking of something else. Maybe he only does it when you play as Claire B instead of Leon. Or maybe I just run the sequence in a different order. Maybe if I had got this. Well, no, because you wouldn't, would you? I was going to say if you got this plug before you got another one, but. I don't know why you're bored. Oh, Geronimo! And we're back here. No! Get, Get away! No! Rip Ben. Birkin is on patrol. Again, none of this makes any sense because he's literally down this corridor. So where does Birkin disappear to? So the only way in and out. Birkin just vanishes. Would have made more sense to have the fight here, I think. Can you still hear me? Come on, answer! Damn! I don't believe this. I almost got the story. <coughs> ben. <laughs> Bitter irony. The chief of police, a co conspirator. Get that scum. Make him pay. Hang in there, Ben. Leon. Mail to the chief. Assume we haven't read this one. 
We have lost the mansion lab facility due to the actions of your renegade officers. I think we did read this one. This is the one that you find right before you fight the boss for Claire. Because it was past the the door with the, the stones you have to put in right before you go down the left into his torture room. Yeah, we did read this one. And he's already dead, I'm pretty sure, so you ain't got to worry, Ben. Going, Ada? To the chemical plant. I have a feeling that's where I'll find John. Ada! Wait! Hey! John's dead. We think. I don't actually find his body. Still there? We're leaving. Are you crazy? The streets are still crawling with zombies. It'll be alright, trust me. We found a way to the sewer. Follow us later. Claire! Claire! Wait, wait! I don't know how to get there. Does anyone ever listen to me? Women, am I right? So that's the point when she's just fought the boss and Chief Irons has died when she rings you there. So Ben has got his wish. The guy's already dead. Anything else in here? How did... William Burke can get in there and kill him. He just broke the door, I guess. Okay, we've got to run the gauntlet of Spider Corridor again. Oops. One last time, though. But that's it for the police station. We are done. Yeah, I kind of wish I'd let them bust out now. I'm just curious if there's anything actually in those cages. Get ready to run. You guys suck. You had one job and that was to let nobody through. You let me through three times now? Okay, we want to save. Because we got a boss fight coming up. Not that I'm worried, because we got the Magnum and plenty of bullets. Which I'll probably just use anyway. But I generally save before bosses in case something goes wrong. Uh, we need the other plug. Where did I store that stupid thing? There it is. I'll reload the shotgun. Okay. Store those shells. Yeah, that'll do. We'll, we'll be coming back to throw the Magnum back in here once the boss is dead, I think. Well, let's just save. Say goodbye to Claire's saves. I might not oversave the first. Leon save because that's technically the end of Claire's campaign and the start of this one. Just so we can like do this campaign again if we wanted to without having to go through Claire's first. Uh, store this, I guess. And let's go deal with this mess. There's William in his early, very early phase, I guess. Don't really get to see him too much like this. There's Claire. Maybe briefly. 
from a distance. I don't know why he needs a pole. Doesn't he have claws? Or how many does he take? That's six. Oh, I thought you were going down. I think he has to limp over and just fall down. Well, I actually don't want to caution his uh, death swing there. Whenever you're ready, buddy. Oh, you got me! You Bye! Pleasure as always. Are we going to have a safe room coming up? I think we might do. Do we need to dump this right now, do you think? We're in. 